Hey, what's going on guys? We just made it to Aussie land. Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Oi, oi, oi. So excited to be down here, guys. We're gonna be spending the next month in Australia and I'm super excited to share this place with you. The first place we just got to was Springbrook National Park, which is about one hour from Fingalhead, where we just drove from. And we just got to the top of the cliffs here and I'm already seeing these amazing views. Can't wait to get the drone up there. Can't wait to show you guys how beautiful this place is. So guys, we're really excited to be here in Australia because Lindsay and John, who we're gonna be with later, are showing us all around the Gold Coast area so we're super excited to see them because Chelsea has known them for like 10 years now and they go way back to roommates in college so we're gonna have so much fun together and Lindsay's gonna tell us a little bit more about this park so this is Springbrook it's an amazing place to go hiking it has waterfalls um, a couple trails the trail that we're gonna do is Twin Falls it takes about two hours four kilometers so it's an easy hike there's the Wari circuit as well and then there's a natural bridge, which is one to check out if you don't have as much time. If you look way off in the distance, you can see a couple chops in Gold Coast. Woo! Kelsey. Kelsey, Kelsey! Careful with that, don't trip. Lindsay's got her stick just in case we need to fight off any massive snakes. Or spiders. 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 All the dangerous things in this forest. <laughs> We have a wild gazelle we found in the forest. <laughs> Two wild gazelles. I have a feeling we're going to be looking at a lot of beautiful lookout points for the next two hours on this hike. I thought it was a snake for a second. <laughs> Good eye. Yeah, not... We're in nature though. Oh, that's one of those ones that's poisonous, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. Oh, It'll really? bite your toe off. Okay, there we wow. go. Wow. That's a big in. Holy <laughs> Like, did you smell like fat? <laughs> 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 Good news is we made it past safely, so we're moving on. That's the second encounter with one of these things while we're walking through here, mites. And Dom, I must say, I'm a little scarred. As we take this video, today is a record for Australia, the highest temperature nationwide. And you can tell right here because we're sitting in front of what's normally a waterfall but it is so dry here right now that it's almost completely dried up. Pretty crazy, pretty scary too. We use another plant for foundation as they grow. The Tarzan vines you see hanging from the treetops are called Le Liana. These large woody vines can grow over 50 meters long, 20 centimeters thick, using a tree for support as they climb towards the sunlight. Now there are so many sounds of like different animals in here. You can just like hear things running around, so it's like kind of like scary because first time being in here you hear of all of like the dangerous things that are in these forests and then you hear all these noises, but it's like so cool it adds to that thrill. These are important colonizers of regenerating subtropical rainforests. Regeneration occurs after storm damage to the forest, natural occurrences like fire and man-made disturbances. Where's the stinger? <laughs> Watch out for the leaves. They may be stinging. I don't know, but that kind of looked like the photo right there. Or maybe these could be it. Comment if you know. Like I was saying, it's so dry here. Normally, you can walk right through here, like under the waterfall, and it's literally just a couple trips right now, so kind of sad. And hopefully this place gets some rain ASAP. Bye, Twin Falls. So we're here on a Wednesday right now, and it's just the start of the summer season and there's not too many people here which is really great we've been walking for like 30 minutes now and i've probably only passed like a total of four people so like you really feel like you're out here alone so definitely be careful but enjoy it because going to some of the places where there's people everywhere you don't really get as much of a feeling as like being connected to the nature like this except when you're here and there's not many people around so it's pretty cool you can only hear like the noises of the jungle i wonder if bigfoot lives in there 
because there is room for a couple Bigfoots in this huge tree. Also be really careful when you're walking around here because the ledges are so steep here and like one trip you could literally go tumbling off the mountain so be like really really careful here so guys after being like 45 minutes in something i should let you know is bring shoes that have a grip on them like my shoes they have no grip and the leaves some of the stairs they're really really slippery and with how steep these trails are you're going to really want something that makes you feel safe and then also there's two different trails you can take one's level three that's the one we're on and then there's four for more experienced people i can't tell you much about it except they do recommend that you have experience climbing around these trails so much cool nature in here literally everywhere you step and like walk and look up there's so many cool things it's amazing this is the straggler fig these figs are strangler here. fig Strangler fig. <laughs> yeah. It begins life high on a tree as a seed deposited by birds or bats. While seedlings on the forest floor, they struggle to reach the sunlight canopy. The young fig is there and flourishing. As it grows, its roots descend to the ground, encasing the host and slowly strangling it by reducing sap flow. And the host tree dies and decays, enriching the soil with nutrients. Nature. Nature. Some pretty crazy nature. So Mac and I are typically beach people. So whenever we do a hike like this, it really opens us up and makes us want to do more of them. This hike has been incredible. We're in a rainforest. As you can see, you can go behind waterfalls and you pass a bunch on your way. It's so beautiful, so green, so luscious. It's not too difficult, like you can do it, just bring some good hiking shoes and you're good to go for an incredible afternoon. Wow, literally every corner we have turned on this trail has been a new surprise. We're walking through these two like massive cliffs that leave like a five foot clearance and it just popped up out of nowhere. So like every single turn you take, you're up for a new surprise when you're here. So the landscape here at Spring Brook, um, this plateau is part of a remnant of the massive volcano that was here um, 23 million years ago, which is pretty amazing. 23 million years ago, and we're walking through it. Don't be alarmed, but there is wildlife just around this corner. Wildlife. I'll show you wildlife. Come check it out. Wildlife. Wildlife. Come around the corner. Nature. Ready? Nope, you're gonna scare me. <gasps> Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> it's an Australian they, they bite? turkey. No. Oh. Where does it go? Wow. It's gotta pass us, right? Oh. Turkey! What's up? More wildlife. Holy! <laughs> wow! Does that one taste like a normal turkey? No. Yeah, they're protected. Oh. So these are Australian brush turkeys. So up here you see an Australian wattle, which is the native flower of Australia. All right guys, we just finished up the Twin Falls hike in Springbrook National Park. It took us about two hours, but we stopped and we filmed different shots, but should take you about an hour and a half. Um, so maybe bring a snack, but it was amazing, it's beautiful. It was a picture perfect afternoon, as you can see. This is the first of many videos that we will be making while we're here in Australia for the next three, four weeks. We're so excited. We can't wait to share everything with you guys. If you want to see these videos, if you want to see more, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you.